And unfortunately, currently there's no building or facilities that I can access with her out with a school building that gives her the opportunity to be with friends in a, an environment that's welcoming and actually has the facilities that she needs. Um, for example, youth groups. I would love to take my daughter to a youth group, but there's nowhere that I can take her. It is about addressing disadvantage. It, they've got big aims and big outcomes in their plans and it, it, it is about addressing disadvantage and inequality, providing services locally that people here can access. The walls of this 140 year old building may be starting to show their age, but it's the history they hold which makes this place worth saving. It taught generations of the town's children before it was turned into council offices, and it was even used as the investigation headquarters during the Lockerbie Air disaster, which devastated the town. The building itself had so many memories, so many people in this area have been through school in this in this building and then of course with the, the, the connections with the Pan Am 103 uh, air disaster and the investigations that took place in this building. I think that's where it started off from this the, the sort of want the fight to preserve the building 